for joining us today for our third annual Buggy Awards. I'm Sam Houston, Senior Community Manager here at Bug Crowd, and I'm excited to welcome you back and uh, recognize our fantastic customers and researchers. We have a lot of great awards today, um, but first I'd like to invite our Senior Director of Operations, Abby Mulligan, to tell you a little bit more about the awards and why we're here today. Um, I'm <laughs> Hello. Uh, I'm thrilled to be kicking off the uh, the third annual Buggy Awards. We've got a great lineup for everyone today. Uh, but before we get started, I wanted to just say a few words about why we do um, why we do the buggies and why it's so important to us, as well as me personally. Um, what we like to do each year is recognize the folks from around the world for all of their extraordinary work in the bug bounty space in 2017. Today we'll be awarding three organizations for their commitment to making their bug bounty program successful and five researchers um, who have contributed tremendously to the, uh, the bug bounty space as well as the community as a whole. I've had the personal pleasure of working very closely with a lot of these folks and I'm, without further ado, I'm going to introduce some folks that are going to present our uh, program awards. Sean, Kayla, and Ashish. Thanks, Abby. Uh, is everyone near me? No, you gotta move it up. Move it up? Okay. Crouch down. Right. Uh, thank you, everyone, for joining us here at Local Edition. Uh, my name is Sean Reed. I'm on the customer success team at Bug Crowd. Um, and so we're glad to have the opportunity, opportunity to award three of our top bug bounty programs for their responsiveness. The truth is, bug, bounty, bug Crowd works with tons of incredible companies who have done some amazing work in the past year. Today, we're recognizing the top three programs. Uh, with our most responsive program, excuse me, most responsive program award, we'll be recognizing the customers who have committed themselves to providing an awesome experience and fast response times on their bug bounty programs. The award represents the customer who's truly on top of their program in processing and rewarding bugs, as well as engaging with their researchers. This award is important because transparency and swift communication is one of the keys to maintaining a <laughs> maintaining a solid relationship with the researcher community. So in third place, we have Atlassian. Right. And in second place, we have TripAdvisor. And the winner of the public program with the best response time and commitment is Netflix. Thank you, John. Again, my name is Kayla, and I've been with Bug Crowd for about two years. First on the researcher side, but I've moved over to the customer side just recently. The next award we'll be presenting is Program of the Year which recognizes some of the most well-rounded programs on the Bug Crowd platform. In setting up, running, and iterating upon bug batting programs, we encourage our customers to be thoughtful, clear, and generous. This award recognizes the programs that fit those criteria in terms of several variables, including breadth and complexity of scope, reward ranges offered, rewards paid, communication with researchers, and general effort. And third place, we have HubSpot. Second place, we have Netflix. <laughs> and our winner is Atlassian. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Yes. Congratulations. And with that, I'd like to pass off to Ashish Gupta, Bug Crowd CEO, to present our next award. Thank you very much, Kayla, and thank you everyone for being here to celebrate the Buggy Awards 2018. This is just phenomenal because in the last seven months that I've been here at Bug Crowd, I've really gained a keen appreciation for the value our researchers bring to our customers and the value our customers believe the researchers are delivering with all the things that they do to make those vulnerabilities go away. So it's a 
just a privilege to be here. It's a privilege to have all of you here to celebrate these awards. With that, I'd like to move on to our last award, which is a very special accolade. It's the Best Program Researcher's Choice Award. This is where our researchers have actually nominated programs as the industry's best programs. We did a survey, and we've actually done two of those these year, this year, where we've asked some researchers which programs would they nominate as the best and why. And to that end, the best programs in the bug bounty space as nominated by our community are, in third place, Tesla. In second, place, in second place, we'd like to congratulate Atlassian once again. <laughs> and in first place, the best program, Researcher's Choice Award, goes to Netgear. I'd like to thank you much. led the way when it comes to keeping customers safely connected to the internet and to each other. Uh, for Netgear, it's not simply about growing the threat of breaches, or about the growing threat of breaches, or even the outside pressure from cyber criminals, although these are very real drivers. It's about being responsive, a responsive citizen in, in our digital economy. Uh, crowdsourced security is about building comprehensive security programs, effectively identifying variables and ensuring that they are successfully remediated. Netgear has continuously demonstrated not only its commitment to making its products safer, but also uh, but also that is taking action, delivering the promise of security. And the community has clearly taken notice. Harnessing the deep, diverse skills of our security researchers around the world allows them to scale their security assessment <laughs> strategies. Cooperation and an openness to collaborate with our researchers makes all of this possible. Again, we'd like to thank all of our customers and all of our researchers for the work they put in over the past year, and we look forward to the rest of 2018. Thank you. I want to really thank Bug Crowd for allowing us to connect to our researchers. Very important. Um, we just started Bug Bounty last year, and since then, getting this award is unbelievable. So we feel very happy and privileged to be part of it. Uh, second, I want to thank Netgear team. It's all back there, uh -huh. everyone. Right? <laughs> Tremendous work last year. Uh, we didn't know when we started our Bug Bounty, how we're going to do it, how many bugs we're going to get. We got thousands and thousands of bugs. And we were able to work with the engineering team, uh, PSR, PSR team, bug crowd team. We were able to make a lot of progress. So very happy with that. And third and most important, I want to really thank our researchers. Without them, this program is not possible. If you are here, uh, love to meet with them, mingle with them. If you're not here, and if you're seeing this video, uh, just know that we are really serious about security. And we'll continue to invest in this program. We want to do, uh, work more closely with you in a different kind of program. So really, really appreciate it. Thank you so much. All right. And now for our researcher awards. We have so many researchers that do great work and deserve recognition. While we reward researchers for monthly performance and we have an all-time leaderboard, the Buggy Awards give us an opportunity to recognize researchers that have done amazing work over the past year. The awards we are recognizing today are completely objective, as we wanted to be as fair as possible and only reward their research. Our researchers are all around the world and we'll be sending these awards to all of the winners. To introduce our first award, the P1 Warrior, please welcome to the stage Researcher Success Project Manager, Abigail Nye. Awesome, thank you, Sam. Um, yeah, 
So, our first researcher award recognizes the researcher with the most non-duplicate P1s. Each of our finalists in this category have gone above and beyond, submitting the highest quality bugs in 2017, providing tremendous insight, feedback, and value to the organization. Many hours have gone into these critical vulnerabilities over the past year, and today we honor the three researchers who found the most. So with that being said, this year's P1 Warriors are, in third place, Justin Kennedy. Woo! In second place is Sandeep V. And the winner is Mongo. Congratulations to all of our finalists. We really appreciate all your hard work. And now I'd like to introduce our researcher success program manager, Chloe Brown. Thank you, Abigail. Our second researcher award recognizes researchers with the greatest number of non-duplicate kudos points earned through disclosure programs. If you're not familiar with how kudos, how kudos points work, each researcher that submits a vulnerability through Bug Crowd receives kudos points weighted by the severity of the submission. Critical P1 vulnerability earns 40 points, a low severity earns five. It's important to understand that as we recognize the accomplishments of our finalists in this category. In third place, we have Today is New. In second place, we have Ahmed Ihani. And the winner is Sandeep B. bring Sam back to introduce our final category, or our next category. Uh, thank you, Chloe. So the, the Buggy Awards are our opportunity to take a moment to recognize the work done in the past year, both on the program side and within the researcher community at large. Our next award is the Researcher Community Involvement Award. In the community, sharing knowledge, tips, and resources is crucial. There have been many researchers who have contributed positively over the last year, and I'm happy to recognize these three individuals who stood out from the crowd. First, we have Noob. <laughs> we have uh, The Gentleman. And lastly, we have Today is New. So with this award, we're recognizing them for their contributions all across the community, whether it's in, on Twitter, our GitHub comments, giving us feedback on what we're working on through private feedback, or just generally being a great and positive member of the community. So we'd like to thank all three of these researchers for their positive contributions to the researcher community, and we're super excited to see what they do in 2018. So next, I'd like to welcome our founder and CTO, Casey Ellis, to the stage to introduce our MVH, the Most Valuable Hacker Award. Thank you, Sam. Thank you, everyone, for coming. This is uh, very exciting stuff, right? Um, as Sam mentions, we regularly recognize our crowd uh, and the leaders within our crowd for their contributions. This is really our core mission at Bug Crowd. We're passionate not only about making the internet a safer and more secure place, but by providing and, and by creating opportunities and uh, you know, potential for these hackers that are out there on the internet to, to connect with what they do best, with what they love, and how they can contribute to, uh, to make things better, right? The uh, last researcher award we're giving out today is the MVH Award, the most valuable hacker. The finalists for this category do not just submit high severity bugs or a high volume of bugs or have a high rate of accuracy. They do all three of these things. So that's pretty hardcore. People that can pull that off, they're doing all right. <laughs> um, this year, the MVH is given to the researcher with the best combined rankings across the following categories. Average technical severity, accuracy, and volume of valid and accepted submissions. The number of researchers that actually met this criteria was pretty awesome. Uh, these researchers are all around brilliant, they're hardworking, they're creative and talented people, and we're honored to recognize the top, the top three finalists in this category. So in the third place, we have Darky Duck. And they're all legends too, by the way, uh, so there's that. 
In second place, we have Justin Kennedy. And the buggy for MVH goes to, uh, affectionately known as the destroyer around the office, the one and only Mongo. And Mongo will accept your acceptance speech via Twitter. Lots of goes up on YouTube, so thanks, mate. Uh, I wanted to congratulate all of the uh, the nine researchers that we've acknowledged here today. Our crowd is comprised of some of the best talent in the world uh, when it comes to offensive security, security research, hacking, breaking into things whilst not being a bad person and doing it, and uh, seeking to help, seeking to help make the internet safer and uh, uh, generally make us all smarter at, uh, at keeping our data and our customers secure. Um, but seriously, this whole idea and the success of crowdsourced security is built on the idea that good guys can think like bad guys and find vulnerabilities before the adversaries take advantage of them. So I wanted to thank everyone in the crowd, all of our customers too. I uh, really appreciate the, the work that you guys do because this is a relationship between the folks that build software and the folks that can break it and want to help. So thank you so much for coming. Really appreciate it. All right. So that's it for us today. Throughout the year, we take the time to acknowledge folks that make our security world go round and, and make our jobs more fun. We sincerely enjoy working with each and every one of you, whether you're here in the audience or uh, joining us around the world. And we feel it's necessary to engage with the community and make sure that your hard work does not go unseen. This year is young, and we've already seen some awesome, amazing research. So we can't wait to see what the rest of this year brings. So we'll see you next year.